Bismillahirrahmanirrahim and Rahim uh, and welcome back to this next video and uh, this is a video in the series of videos on bioinformatics where I'll be focusing on the uh, XPACI. Now uh, the first thing you need to know is what is XPACI. So you go to the website of the XPACI like the expasy.org and uh, when you uh, click on this uh, particular link that is going to lead you to the main page of the XPACI. Now, this XPACI is uh, actually uh, a portal. It is not a, a database. So the uh, major difference between the database and the portal is that a, that a database focuses on a particular thing, uh, but a portal provides you access to many different kinds of the resources and many different kinds of the databases. So when you talk about the XPACI, you are actually dealing with a portal and not uh, with uh, a database. Now this XPC, it, it is uh, actually uh, controlled by the, or it is governed by the Swiss Institute of the Bioinformatics and it gives you a lot of information. Uh, for example, uh, if you look on the uh, left side, uh, this is the main page of the XPC and on the left side, you are going to see the uh, information that you can retrieve using the uh, XPC website. So if you are interested in the gene and the genomics, you can do that on the XPC. It also give you information on the proteins and the proteomes, uh, the evolution and the phylogeny, including the evolutionary biology and the population genetics. There are resources available for the uh, structural biology in which you can go for the drug design, the medicinal chemistry, uh, the structure analysis. There are also, uh, you can say, resources and databases which you can access through XPC for the system biology including the uh, glycomics, the uh, lipidomics, the metabolomics, and uh, uh, you can also go for the text mining and the uh, machine learning. Now that means that XPZ is a, a very extensive kind of the portal and it gives you a lot of information, especially when you are doing your research uh, in the field of the bioinformatics. So uh, in the next video, I'll give you an example uh, from this uh, XPZ that uh, what important kind of the uh, uh, resources uh, or the uh, databases or the programs that are available on the uh, uh, XPZ that you can use for your uh, research.